Have you ever wondered what's the difference between a basic, intermediate and advanced jet trainer? Let's look at Bangladesh Air Force's fleet of training aircraft to understand the difference and what each one is used for. For the basic trainer category, we're going to use Bangladesh's BBT-2 as our example. BBT-2 is a turboprop basic trainer aircraft made by Bangladesh. The majority of basic trainer aircraft around the world are all turboprop aircrafts. So what is a turboprop aircraft? Turboprop refers to the engine. A turboprop engine is an engine that drives a propeller to create momentum, thrust and lift. Slower speeds of turboprop engines make it easier for newer pilots to learn how to take off and land the aircraft. The slower speed of the aircraft also makes it easier for them to learn how to handle it in the air. Turboprop engines are also incredibly fuel efficient, so new pilots can stay in the air for long hours without having to worry about coming down to refuel. They have very basic avionics, cannot carry any weapons and cannot perform any complicated maneuvers. Intermediate Jet Trainers We're going to be using Bangladesh Air Force's K-8Ws as our example for this section. The biggest difference between a turboprop basic trainer and an intermediate jet trainer is that intermediate trainers have jet engines which are a lot more powerful and complicated than turboprop engines. Because of this increase in power, turbofan jet engines generate a lot more thrust and speed allowing pilots to conduct advanced maneuvering training. Intermediate jet trainers like our K-8Ws are also capable of light attack, allowing pilots to conduct basic weapons training with short-range air-to-air missiles, small guided and unguided bombs, and rocket pods. For the advanced lead-in fighter trainer section, we will be using Bangladesh Air Force's Yak-130 as the example aircraft. Fighter jet training begins with intermediate jet trainers and is completed with advanced jet trainers. They both use jet engines, but the Yak-130 has two engines compared to the K-8Ws-1. So the Yak-130 can perform even more advanced maneuvers, being able to mimic dogfighting. The Yak-130 also has almost double the weapon hardpoints of the K-8W. It also has a multi-mode radar system allowing pilots to train for beyond visual range combat, target tracking, and air-to-ground strike missions. A advanced jet trainer has everything needed to prepare a pilot for a frontline fighter jet. So let's recap. Basic trainers teach fundamental flying skills to new pilots. Intermediate jet trainers teach jet handling, high speed, formation flying, aerobatics, and basic weapons training. Advanced jet trainers prepare pilots for frontline fighter jets with high-speed maneuvering, radar operation, BVR combat, and advanced weapons training mimicking real-life combat aircraft. Thank you for watching the video to the end. If you wish to support me, you can like the video and subscribe. I also upload YouTube shorts to this channel, so make sure to watch those. Until next time.